expecting a lot of different things from this club over the year. What will they bring here tonight? Anyone's guess. Jeremy Shear, our referee, blows the whistle, and here we go. Mitch Tanner going to lock one over the top. He's got a point to prove against his former side here tonight. And he just has to be careful. Now, one more challenge. It probably will be a yellow card for him. Girl moving forward in the box, trying to slide forward. Over the physicality. And there is the goal, but it is going to be a penalty first. They point to the spot of PK coming for Sacramento. Girl picks up that ball, and he's driving through and just scythed from behind. <laughs> and it was Connor. Maloney, I believe it was, and that is... That is tough for Jack Gurry. He's getting some treatment right now. And now the penalty kick for Sebastian Herrera looking for goal number three. Net number four, and there it is. We're in the sixth minute of the game. Just like Russell Cicerone has, you get a chance. Finding Herrera, he's in the box, lays it back to Villadere. Villadere may serve this. No, he's gonna maybe take another couple dribbles. Across the box, go to the hard left, go to the Oh, what a slam, what a shot, Jack Gurr. And what a service from Dami Vianer and the Republic had the game's second goal in the 38th minute. Jack Gurr was just waiting for it and he connects and Conor Maloney's not, nothing he can do about that. Kind of knocks it into his own net. But what? Along the right side, Azucar again trying to get deep into the final third. And this one's through. Bailoni, Bailoni will put it through and in. And San Antonio's right back into this game. That's what makes Ignacio Bailoni so dangerous. His After a season away, and look at this. Uh, that's great play by Olawashi. Just slides that ball perfectly through. Bailoni can take it first time. He just lets the ball come across to a stronger left foot. But the Republic got really, really stretched to commit. Keka will try to get this on the outside of foot. Herrera take it down by Jordan Farr. And there's a red card, and Jordan Farr is out of the game. And a big time substitution is going to come here for Alan Marcina as Herrera was charging in on goal. Yeah, he just doesn't give up, Sebastian. I didn't even think he was going to get to that. And straight red card given to him, Jordan. For any time you're a goalkeeper, you come up that. Take some shots on goal. You get <laughs> you get a defender in there. So test his hands. Just hit the target here if you're Luis Felipe. Felipe run up. Felipe, what a banger! Oh my goodness, Luis Felipe! I don't care who's in the box. They're not stopping that one, and the crowd is losing it here in Sacramento. What a way to finish the night. Luis Felipe steps up and just slams that into the top corner. Jordan Farr might have had some trouble getting to that one, so. I mean, the height of Fabian Garcia couldn't get to it. I don't know if Jordan Farr is as good as Jordan Farr has been over the last two seasons. Just quite impressive for how good both of these teams have been for so many years. Keko is taken out by Mitch Tainer, who receives a yellow, and Sosa coming chest to chest. There's three minutes of stoppage time, but this one might be over quickly. There's the second yellow for Tainer, and that is it. Slow to get up on the other side, and let's take another look at this. Yeah, to be honest, it's probably a red card for that tackle anyway, so. He Minute goal, and then it was a barrage from there for Republic. They score three in this game.